YouTube. <laughs> welcome back to the Active on the YouTube channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not new here, welcome back, y'all. And from the title, you can see that this is a totally different type of video. Instead of getting active today, we're going to be reacting today. Because if you weren't aware of this, I actually started my YouTube channel in 2018. I like put out like nine videos, but it was when I was living in Ireland. So like I didn't really know no one out there, obviously. And I just didn't care, you know, but once I moved back to the States, I just kind of like shut down. You know, I wasn't mentally prepared to take on the responsibility of having a YouTube channel. And I just, yeah, like I didn't know really what I wanted to put out. I didn't, I cared too much what people thought. I just, yeah, you know, like mentally, I just really was not ready. Um, but it's funny. I'm looking back at some of these videos and two actually were like movement videos. And then a few of the other ones were just like, <laughs> maybe I'll do reactions to them at some point but they're like embarrassing <laughs> but we're gonna get into it i'm gonna share with y'all two of my active i had one video called i'm gonna just show y'all right now hold on okay this, this is so embarrassing <laughs> so this is my daily workout routine so this is like kind of what i was doing in ireland at the time You'll see I'm actually, I work out in a, in the gym that was on my campus because I was staying at a campus. I was staying on a campus in Ireland, Ulster University. Ruined it. <laughs> so this was my intro when I first, my, my first take of YouTube. Oh Oh my god, you guys, I think the worst part about recording yourself is starting the video. And then once you get past that, everything is good. Oh my god, I hate starting this. this. Is, like, this is just gonna be so cringe. Videos. <laughs> but anyway, let's get into it. So, uh, today I thought that I'd just give you guys... Oh, it's cool though that I keep... I always used to say, let's get into it. Some advice on my experience with going to the gym, like my workout routines and whatever because i think sometimes it can be a little bit intimidating to watch like the real like professional trainers or like the like those instagram models or stuff instagram fit models and all that stuff like i think sometimes it could be really really intimidating whereas if you just hear it from like this is like my college dorm and i want like they're normal but you know like someone that's not as like glamorous as them it makes it sometimes easier so yeah that's why i'm giving you guys my uh opinion so any but but with that being said i am no professional trainer i am like i'm none of that so these are just my opinions okay i feel like i started the video off pretty well and my experience so when it comes to my work how old am i here i'm 23 this is 18 18 19 20 21 22 23 yeah I'm now and eating i eat so freaking bad like i will binge eat so much like i'll eat like a whole sleeve of cookies at like 9 30 10 o'clock at night with no care in the world i will eat a whole tub of ice cream i think this is still me minus eating tubs of ice cream but i really used to do that in college like i would literally go get the metropolitan neapolitan however you want to say it, and i would literally eat a gallon in one sitting <laughs> with like a bag of Lay's chips not even kidding I think last night I ate a whole half a tub of ice cream super late at night with no care in the world and we had like a little convenience store like it was like a 30 second walk from where I stayed and they sold oh my god they sold Oreos there Oreo flavors that I never even had before like double double brownie mint I've seen mint here but they just they sold flavors that I never saw in my life and they were so good then their candies and their sweets were just way better than the, than the states like I and it was only like one euro so like I went there a lot because I just don't care I'm going to eat and I'm not going to starve myself and um but with that being said I think you need to balance that with working out so if you're gonna decide to eat really really bad like i decide to do then you should go to the gym and i know it can be hard to go to the gym but like just you don't have to go to the gym for an hour and an hour and a half two hours to, and just run on the treadmills and sweat 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 no you can do light light lifting light weights it doesn't need to be anything like super heavy lifting or anything like that you just really need a balance and that's what I feel like has worked best for me. And I think that I have a pretty, like, not to seem all cocky, but I think I have, like, my body physique is 
is pretty in shape for someone that eats really really bad it's kind of nice though to see that like my mentality hasn't necessarily shifted too much i guess that's kind of cool to see from here i've just grown to evolve to have just a better understanding but for the most part you know at 23 i was not too bad so that would just be my advice just like because i still feel the same way it's all about balance i eat a little bit healthier now but i still feel like um you just have to have a balance in your life really i'd be preaching that on my instagram so, real oh, i'll just have a balance so i in this video i just show you guys some really simple arm workouts you can do and some really simple leg workouts you can do and to finish it off with some abs so i hope that you guys enjoy it Hey guys, so these are seated rows. I'm sure almost every gym will have this machine. Really simple. You just want to make sure you're seated straight up as possible. And when you roll back, try to hold it for about body. three seconds. And then I, or and I do about three seconds. Wearing. The next exercise will be... You know when you're shy in the gym with filming, you just have to place the camera anywhere? Yeah, that was me. The bench press with dumbbells. Um, it's a little bit easier to do with dumbbells because with the bar you're set with that weight whereas you can pick a lighter uh, weight than what the bar is and once again I do about three sets of ten the next one is dumbbell fly so whatever weight's easy for you and then as you can see when I turn to the side but so hopefully like in the next month or so I will be getting back into lifting and having more videos like this but better quality better just everything but it's cool to see that I you know you want to have a slight bend in your knee because I haven't had much hasn't changed in terms of just me working out and movement and stuff so which is kind of cool to see and a little hunched over so that you can really work on those, those back muscles and once again about three sets of ten this exercise is a little bit more challenging called renegade rose but you can modify it by either going on your knees and doing it or just taking out the weights and just doing normal push-ups and once again i'll probably do about three sets of five because those are really challenging i was so tired this is a new day it's my leg day and i usually start off with back squats you want to make, make sure your feet are shoulder width apart so and like, really what push do i have on and look how y'all see how i'm like so squatting and arching and squeezing when i come to that and so you bad up, you really want to my lifting has improved over time, really that's for sure. Muscles. And I do three sets of ten. You can go up with the weight every set or you can leave it the same, whichever you think is best for you. These are split squats, so you want to make sure that you have a good weight for yourself and make sure you're balanced. As you can see, I kept falling before I, start, before I started. Um, with these, I'll usually do... Mm, five on each leg it depends sometimes i'll do five to eight reps on each leg but i'll do it for three sets and you can once again go up with weight or keep it the same which is easier and i just add a little dance in the end <laughs> no one was in the gym um these are standing leg curls um these are kind of tough so i do about three five three sets of five on each leg like, and nothing really special just want to make sure you're real like sturdy with those. Those. These are cat like, phrases that I like to finish my what late workouts with. As you guys can see, I have really skin cat, skinny calves, so I'm trying to build them up. And then I just add the dumbbell weight to just add more weight to that I'm pushing up. So you don't have to do that, it's just something that I do. And then finally I finished all of my workouts, all of my workouts with abs. And this was the toe toe touch app, so you just kinda find it. But it's kinda cool to see that like nothing's Actually, changed in terms of me working and out and stuff leg, but and the, the videoing and, and what am i wearing i mean i don't be caring i still don't be and caring do honestly 10. so i do about 10 or no i do three sets of 10 with each exercise even per leg so it's, it's pretty it can be pretty difficult but modify it if you have to and then finally we have to work on those oblique muscles because those are the ones that you don't want to have those love handles so they're just like i don't forget what these called like bridges up down bridges side bridges whatever and i just do about three sets of ten and my workouts are as simple as that i hope you enjoyed don't forget to like subscribe leave a comment <laughs> oh yeah that's one of them let me show you the other one
Okay, here is the next video. This one's called Girls Know How to Play Basketball 2. <laughs> oh, this is like our gym where I played most of my, uh, a lot of my games and when I played in Ireland. <laughs> Remember when dabbing was a thing? Ruined it. <laughs> that was a little my channel. But yeah, like I've always enjoyed just moving because I just went and recorded. I got one time. I think there one of my teammates was shooting at the other end. And we just went to go play, and then I was like, you know what, I'm going to film a video, because why not? Like another movement video. But at the time, I didn't really know that, like what I was doing. Like, I had two movement videos on my channel, and then I have like a sister tag, I have get to know me tag, I have... Um, I drank my sister's breast milk and she did like the cinnamon challenge. Um, so it was just like, I forget what another video is on there, but I still have those shorts. I just wore them last night to bed. <laughs> But, I don't know, it's kind of cool to see, like, videos from back then. This video is not too embarrassing, because I didn't really talk. Um, I just shot around and did silly stuff. But, like, some of my other videos where I'm talking, and some of the stuff I was saying, oh my gosh, embarrassing. But A, what's that, 15, 16, 17, and then I get like 22, 18, But it's cool too, like my editing. I look, I like look at my editing too. Like, oh, that's how you was doing the editing a little bit too. Though. I feel like I'm a little bit better now. But this video isn't cringe too much, and it's short. <laughs> Girls know how to play basketball too. <laughs> like, why is that my title? <laughs> ah. I think at this time I only had gotten like when I did it, when I did YouTube in 2018, I only I had got like 16 subscribers. Now my count is I'm only five away from 200. We're on the two. We're trying to get that 200 before the end of the month. Um, but yeah, y'all, that's it. I just wanted to react to two of videos that were on my channel um, that where I was moving and movement moving in it because it's just cool to see. I don't know. Sometimes when you just diary, like this is kind of like a diary input. What's that thing? Input, whatever. A, like a journal input. What do they call it? I can't think of it. But yeah, I don't know. It's kind of, it's also cool. Like I, I'm glad that I didn't delete these videos off my channel. You can just like make them private. So I just made them private and I just, I don't know. It's kind of cool to just see how I, to watch myself evolve and to see what I used to do in the past and just stuff like that. So that's kind of cool. 
but yeah i hope you guys just enjoyed these little reactions you'll have to comment below if you wanted me to react to the other six videos i have on here i don't know if i would react to all of them because i'm telling you a couple of them are very embarrassing and some and then a couple of them are like natalia you post like what is this? this isn't even like valuable uh content like <laughs> but it's cool to see my growth but yeah y'all i'll see y'all i'll see y'all in my next video make sure you like and subscribe share comment below uh we on a mission to hit that 200 subscriber mark and yeah make sure you get up and get active bye